Actually, the sun is setting now. Water for life. Over here. Anaenda kusalamia maji. Water for life. Unaenda kusalimia maji? Oh, when he said that I want to greet water, meaning that he wants to take shower. Welcome back again to YouTube channel. It's Pablo Junior and Junior is JNR. This guy was trying to illustrate that Mandazi Chapati then rotate the table as it serves the people around that part. So, it's been a super great day. It's probably moment from this end while enjoying this and getting the best stories and the best views from this end. It's always positive vibes, real vibes. While enjoying this, connect to check out the vlog, subscribe, you know, like and share. After everything is okay, it's settled. Let me go and show you the sunset now. The view of the sunset over this area here. And look the way the sun is setting at a super super nice wave. So let me drop this and you can see the view of the whole of the village the way it is. Oh my god, I love operating the GoPro. I just borrowed this one and I'm feeling like getting videos all the time all the way like yeah 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 just taking all the vlog I love I love I love filming a bit a lot and look the way the environment is and over there there is the water heating guys look the solar there they enhance and help in water heating let's go slowly 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 and eventually uh, there they are so everything is great and super nice from this end subscribe first of all like and share oh, you have to be extra careful because i'm on a ladder you are barefoot you know like when you want to climb on the ladder you have to be extra extra careful because if you don't be extra careful you might end up injuring yourself and uh, so i want to go up oh. Look at those clear fish inside the water. Oh my god, they're so nice. So I heard that when you want to go down the ladder, you go backwards. Backwards. Oh no, our phone, our phone. Yeah, let me hold it tight. Yeah, you go backwards. Backwards. In that way. So that that is it. You don't injure yourself. You can look at the beautiful view of the fishes. From this path here they are so beautiful oh my god super nice ones the different colors so let's go down and check out the view of it look we look at myself from the mirror it's been a great day and super great moment for Pablo Jr. great vibes man all the strengths so let's subscribe look at the beautiful chandeliers Feeling blessed and happy with 99 others, live and clear from the village. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. It all depends on the moment you're watching up this vlog also. Good night. All right. Thanks a lot for watching this channel until this moment. Thanks for coming as always. Thanks for subscribing. And let's continue to pray for each other for this for which the Almighty Lord has taken us. As always, we want to be grateful and we shall be always, as always, showing greatness and uh, our potential because you know when you show potential god comes in and boost it boost your potential and you bloom and grow and glow and glow also so it's not a beautiful day and a beautiful time with pablo jr it's so amazing and right now you see there's a, the cloud cover so it seems like it's on a rain today because for the past like uh, four to three days it hasn't rained so and you know if it doesn't rain around this path here uh we have that uh you see the way the ground turns like uh it, the ground is used to high amount of rainfall and so it's another great day 
for the far for the love thanks a lot so watching up this vlog subscribe first of all so that you get the best vibes and best stories as always so it's remember it's always positive great and amazing vibes with pablo jr yeah over there there's a road some people are passing over there so let me take the shelter under here as we bring and open the best vibes and stories as always so oh my god first of all oh there's some webs here let me try to move them out the webs yeah so that we get uh to enjoy and experience that uh, best view oh no no oh no 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 let's try to be around this party yeah in such way it's always amazing man so positive first of all let me take this opportunity to thank our beloved simba around this part this is our security guard yeah take our hands take our hands take our hands yeah you can go as always it's positive it's always amazing and uh, super great as always so man uh let's go and check out some of the most amazing interesting and vibing stories with Virginia, as always remember great positive nice and amazing subscribe subscribe so you see like over this area here we do apply some manure uh which you see here it's uh the local one from the hens yeah, we do apply it just around the kitchen garden here so that the kitchen garden maintain its fertility you see right now the veggies are a bit old but still have to uh like we shall try to make a and plant new one ever blessed ever blessed that is a very nice song live and clear with four sky and 99 others yes you can look the way this environment here it is uh, it's that the longest for the longest moment of time actually i'm passing around this area i don't want to get some uh, blackjack because they are at times tough to move from your uh from the the cloth you know they they come and stick on the cloth and they're very difficult at times to move them from your cloth and so right now the cloud cover is there it's on a rain because it has taken the longest moment of time before it rained so you remember me telling you that oh the hens at times do come and uh get their eggs outside this area man but you never saw i know you believe about it and on uh like uh, the other previous video i hope you checked on that the blessing upon blessing whereby you had found the eggs outside let me look around this part again you may find that there's also another hen which might be giving maybe laying eggs out like generally we try to give them the best uh place to lay because the the houses inside there but they never laid inside so after like uh, i had gotten those eggs out you know what they went back to laying eggs inside the house yeah they were just laying eggs inside the banana plantation over here there is where they were uh, laying the eggs but right now at least we have controlled it yeah, over there is where they were laying the eggs. You see the way they had uh, made it in a very good way. The, uh, also, the guinea falls has that got same character, but they love to lay eggs outside. And let's look at this tree. This plant here, the mango tree, mostly harbors, loves to harvest the the birds at daytime. Yeah, and I don't know if the birds are uh, poisonous. I don't know, but to me, I don't love them. Most of the time, I don't love the birds. I really hate the bats. Yeah, I don't love them. I don't love the bats. I don't know why, but I feel like I don't love them. So let's continue enjoying the vlog. Let's continue subscribing. And uh, if you've been watching Pablo Jr. from the start, early on this, the only on the on the start of the year, I hope you're early on the start of the year until this moment. Hope that we are running and getting and chasing for our dreams as always it's always positive man you know and it's always great that that one i assure you and i'll stick on my positive lane as well as be like positive positive as long as someone dominates on my lane i'm that one humble positive guy and as always we shall be most all day maintaining positive vibes so you see over here ah uh, we have gotten our cassava out this one actually is the one which goes one year eight six months this one and this one 
uh, you can't cook it while raw you have like to remove the outer part and then cook ugali but you can't cook the cassava direct no no this one you can cook it direct because this one is a good breed it goes for six months only and it's ready to be used you see there is the difference actually between this and this this is a traditional and this is a, a bit modernized one you know it's a hybrid i wanna say it because for six months because while it it, it matures for six months it means that this breed uh, was brought up like uh, Tokata for the food shortage. Yeah, that is what I wanna say. That is what I wanna term. And it also cops up with the environment. Cops with the environment. It's amazing. So as always, man, with my great people, my great family members, most of the time, not most of the time, all of the time, I'll be like thanking you a lot, thanking you a lot. As always, I say humbly come and talk to you and give you the best vibes and stories. You are there listening to me, watching me, sharing the vibes with the family, man. Thanks a lot. At this moment, we do entertain. We teach. We also educate. And that is amazing. And uh, that is what we love to do. And as always, we shall be enjoying up the village stories. Village in as always. Best vibes. Oh, over here there was a very very big croc, big lizard. It's known as Rigonkon. It was a big one, not a good one actually. Most of the time, people don't love to sit around. It's better you have the lizard, but not have that the Rigonkon. It's a bit and it's very poisonous. That one I wanna show you. That Rigonkon it's super and super poisonous. It's not a good. Uh, it's not a good. Uh, an animal yeah you see these beautiful beautiful flowers actually this tree has got a lot of history now when i do say about history this one here this tree has got a lot and a lot of history today i want to come up and open up about this tree's history here this tree here if you believe it or not now this big the big father left this young one the big father here has got a lot and a lot of history like first of all let's even sit down while i give you this story ah uh, there are some these birds known as chinserecho now it happened that there was a moment by this area here there was uh uh that moment i was a kid so uh, like uh, we had planted some cassavas around this area here so while my grandmother was getting was harvesting the cassavas i happened to see the birds the bird over this tree so it was just near closely well i was like i wanted to snatch the birds grandma came and be like no let me help you up to get the birds so when she came to help me oh my god the birds came and really really uh uh hey they uh, they really uh sliced our fingers man our hands let me tell you it was so dangerous from that day and I feared that that bird well known as Mserreto. It's so funny. So the, the, the main problem of uh, planting the maize at first, let's uh, first finish the bird story as we before we proceed to another story. So, and uh, it was so frightening to me. And from that day, I really feared the Mserreto bird. The main problem of uh, planting maize, let's say, you don't go the way people have planted first the first time you see it that is that it doesn't bring the best things you see like these maize here they need rain you see but right now the rain is not that uh it's not raining most of the time so that you find that at times the maize may, may end up not doing well because of the way the weather is and that one at least at times we need men to come and uh, ensure that to get the best uh, yields you know, and that is the main problem and defect at times. Yeah, the village there people be like, uh, let me pl plant uh, the last person, let me go for the last uh group, the first group. So the first group most of the time benefits, but the last group, mm, I don't know, but it's well also. So um, I bet you've seen most of the sisal around this part, they are in this shape here. Have you ever asked yourself why? Because sisal is used to make the ropes. The ropes which are used to tie the cows. <laughs> so easy, man. 
just a simple short illustration so there's some of the people actually who come and misuse them not in a good way just like this the cut in a bad way and also the sisal act as boundary between the runners of the plot uh the road may act as a boundary between uh the the clans the clans yeah because like you find this clan this clan a road may separate them a road or a river but with the sisal most of the time it's like when it's uh, dividing the the land it's like division just a boundary man and uh, from the village from africa everything is super amazing as always great the nature the view everything is super great and as always it's beautiful 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 so oh my god i've really missed going to the river i hope that tomorrow i'll have to go to the river like man i enjoy feeling that uh that sound of the river a lot and it becomes like medical sound yes i was trying uh to go back to my older roots you know when i was a kid i could be like <laughs> yeah i could be making some such kind of noises just enjoying man at times you could find that those uh actually they at times you could find that uh there are some which have meanings but there are some which you could like also using them while going early to school like when you make such kind of sound your neighbor the student will be like oh so it's time to school he's prepared let's go there are some of the sounds and from that end i learned about them you know at times when they're living at the village you have to learn and you have to go for a lot and a lot and a lot of uh, stories and learn a lot a lot of uh, interesting vibes also but that one at times oh it's, it's delicate it's a very delicate sound yeah hope that you felt that so it's so great and amazing from this end as always enjoying getting the vibes and stories as usual getting the best stories so asante sana for the people who have been watching this vlog until this moment it's always amazing super great and uh supernatural also and uh, super blessings live and clear from this end that one i'll continue showering you uh the the blessings and the praises because that is true man and we really really love and appreciate that so while watching up this man just hit the like button subscribe and share so that we grow and get the best vibes and stories as always you know together as one unity is strength so amazing so amazing super great super super amazing so from this end here now uh, it's around 4 p.m uh east african time evening hours and today is so chilly today so great always as always and uh, you can look the way things are up and over there is a beehive you know at times the main problem of living with a beehive at times is very very dangerous like i remember there was a, bee, a certain story when i was a kid learning at a certain school uh the bees had attacked the villagers and were told like hey don't get out don't get out the bees may end up affecting you and remember there's a moment a bee stung me yeah oh my god the head crawled like I, I had my head was like going like The, oh my god it was so frightening i feel like oh so what is happening what is happening and then when i was a kid very very big story time uh, with pablo and it's always amazing and great so watching up this subscribe like and share man let's keep it tuned let's live as a family together we grow